opportunity to introduce somebody that is kind of important, Mr. Seth Tuttle. Let's give him a big hand for everything he's done to make all of this happen. Welcome and thank you for being here today. 
on behalf of the Fall Memorial Riding Fund, which is a national organization with state and local chapters, I want to welcome you. Everyone in the organization donates their time 100%. Our national, state, and local chapters uh, do not pay one paid position. So any money we raise here today, that's going to go to the families of loved ones from fallen riders. The Erie uh, County chapter, with your help last year, supporting our ride, our ch uh, celebrity bartender events and other fundraisers, raised $18,000 that we hope to give away. And what we raise this year, we'll have a nice pool of money. The regulations guiding charity organizations such as ours precludes us from directly approaching loved ones of those killed in motorcycle accidents, and we need your help. Please let those people that you know who have loved ones fallen and killed in motorcycle accidents know about us. We are limited as to how we can get our word out about us, and all they need to do is get a hold of one of the board members. We'll give them an application. We're here to help them, and we have the money to do so. So please help us the next time you hear of someone in that position. This chapter in Erie County came about as a result of uh, Mayor Joe Sennett's office and the Manufacturers and Business Association and several riders clubs getting together a few years ago in a meeting regarding the clubs and the Roar and the Shore event. We were very pleased that those clubs that participated in, in riding groups, uh, there, the length is long, but I'm going to read it. We had a bait, the Blue Knights of PA chapter number 18, Fire and Iron, the Chrome Angels, Five of a Kind, the Victory Riders, the Kingsmen, the Iron Wings, Indian Motorcycle Rider Group, Chapter 1901, the Leader of Men, Northern Riders Motorcycle Club, Pride MC, Raka, Number One Stunners, the V Twin Cruisers, and the Warrior Brotherhood. So those were the groups. If I've missed any, I apologize for that, but that was a basic group that got together and decided to make this thing get off the ground. We'd like to thank those groups. Secondly, I'd like to thank the sponsors this year. We have uh, Penn State Baron, which allows us to use this beautiful facility. And you can see we have plenty of room for more bikes next year. Please tell your friends. The Manufacturers and Business Association, the Roar and the Shore, Gary Dutupsky Law, Off-Road Express, Iron Empire Clothing, B&K Country Store, the Sunflower Club, Deuce 2 Printing, Emergency Music Services, they're doing a great job, and Bronson's Auto were sponsors this year. Finally, we would like to thank each and every one of you here today for your support, and I thank the family of loved ones, uh, the loved ones of the family members who fall, want to thank you as well. But please give yourself a big round of applause for being here in this heat. Okay, uh, we're going to draw our ceremony to a close, and uh, this year I want to announce a few people. Uh, we've got people that are, we are riding uh, in memory of a fallen rider, and I'm just going to go quickly through the list. We're going to have a moment of silence. Uh, Brother Vince Rizone is going to say a, a couple words for us. We'll get you the ride instructions of how we're going to pull out of here. It worked out well last year. We were out here in 12 minutes, and what's going to happen after we leave here. And then at uh, 5.59, it kickstands up, and we'll be rolling at 6 o'clock. But if you would, just uh, solemnly bear with me for a moment as we read these fallen riders uh, and their designated rider, memorial rider. Uh, Mike Fidel from Fire and Iron is riding in, in memory of all the fallen firefighters. Astro from Abate is riding in memory of Jerry. Eric Haves, Warrior Brotherhood, is riding in memory of Private First Class Ryan Dixon. Greg Bullis, I hope I get these names correct, leader of men, is riding in memory of Brian Okiki. Uh, JR from Iron Wings is riding in memory of Mort. James Hyeth, Northern Rider Motorcycle Club, is riding for Booger. Tony Culver is riding for Pat, Patrick Bronson. Jonathan Chimenez, uh, Pride MC, is riding for Jack Callahan. Halo, the number one Stunas, is riding for Noon Stuna. Paul Harvey, Blue Knights, is riding for Will Regal. Five of a Kind is riding in memory of Pinky. Brian List is riding 
for Jeremy Horton. Uh, Marie Jones Heslop is riding in memory of Warren Sammy Jones. Chris May is riding in memory of Chevy. Vince Rizone from the Mission Riders is riding in memory of Elliot Turpak. And Leslie, uh, the niece of uh, Mr. Coburn, is riding in memory of Russell Coburn. If we could, just bow our heads for 15 or 20 seconds, and then Vince will uh, get, say a word for us. This group has uh, worked really hard for the last two years, and uh, they've uh, they've tried to do a really good thing, you know. And, and they do a lot of hard work putting this all together. And they they go monthly meetings and actually probably biweekly meetings and uh, everything that they do. And it's hard work, you know. But I think what's really hard would be uh, to have to go to somebody's house and hand them a check when their loved one has passed away, died because of a motorcycle accident. That's probably going to be the hardest thing because that person has a lot of questions. That person wants to know probably why. You know, why him, why her, why so young? And it's questions we can't answer. We don't have the answers, you know? And all I do is tell them I know the who, you know? And it's those times that you have to have faith in God that he'll get you through it, you know? He'll, he just keeps stepping and keep moving forward. And, uh, and I can tell you for a, for a fact that prayer changes things. And if you don't believe me, you can talk to Dick Travers. Uh, who's here today because of prayer. So I'm going to pray real quick. Gentlemen, if you take your caps off, I'm going to pray real quick for a blessing over all of us and over this organization. Father God, I just thank you for allowing me to be here. Father God, I thank you for the blue skies and the sunshine. Uh, Father God, I thank you for this organization that's, that's going out and doing something. I thank you for all the people that are involved with it. I thank you for every rider that came here today, Lord, and I'm just praying a blessing over all of us. I'm praying that you keep us safe this year. And Father God, I'm just praying that you keep this organization moving moving on and moving strong and we'll just give you the glory in Jesus name and everybody says amen thank you Vince uh, the next thing I want to do is just give us our ride instructions then we're going to have Mark uh, our president say a couple words but what we're going to do our uh, Gary Natupski is going to be our uh, Grand Marshal I apologize I almost forgot the term and this area these bikes in this first row are going to leave first. There'll be myself and a couple other people. We're going to work our way up. That far row will be leaving. And we'll work our way back to this parking lot. And then we're going to go and let those bikes in the uh, unpaid or pre unprepaid lot leave. What we're going to do, there's no rush. Uh, we go up on the Knowledge Parkway where we group up. The lead bikes will stop up there. And what will happen is uh, we'll probably take about 10 or 12 minutes to get everybody out of the parking lot. Take your time. There's a couple tricky turns here in getting up on these secondary roads to get up on the Knowledge Parkway. But once we are set up up there on Knowledge Parkway, we are escorted all the way, I should say escorted, all the, all the uh, stoplights are monitored with people. We'll be escorted once we get to the city of Erie, so we've got plenty of time. We're going to take our time. We don't want any accidents on this ride. We don't want anybody to be a beneficiary tonight. So with that in mind, uh, Mark, would you like to say a couple words? Yes, Santa. <laughs> Thank you, everybody, for coming today, helping us support this cause. I know it's really hot out there, so we're going to get going here in a minute. Um, please watch your left as we will have blockers coming up on your left passing us to make sure all the roads are blocked. The police have already asked us also to watch out for them when we get to the city limits. They have six officers. They're going to have more than that lights, so they're going to have to be going past us at a little speed now. Just keep an eye on your left for somebody passing us tonight. Be safe. Enjoy the concert tonight. Welcome to the Roar and Ashore opening ride. <laughs> Folks, that's it. If you want to make your way to your bikes, we're right on schedule. In about five minutes, we'll ask you to uh, start firing them up. <laughs> 